Chance Jamaica to acquire Toll Road Manager GIO for 16 million US dollar. All right, that sounds like over 2 billion Jamaican dollar. If I'm not lie, seeing. All right, so we could get in the article. It's a Gleaner article again that I, if we can get on, on it. All right, we could see if we can get on it. So, Chance Jamaica to acquire Toll Road Manager GIOJ for 16 million Jamaican dollar. Chance Jamaica Highway Limited will pay 16.1 million Jamaican dollar or US dollar, sorry, for the acquisition of all the shares in Jamaica Infrastructure Operator JIO, a French owned company that manages and operates the East West Toll Network on ja Chance Jamaica's behalf on the contract and collects the toll at all four um, toll plazas. All right, so we like this. We're going to talk about this a few. We have been looking at some of Chance Jam's information, so I guess we can talk about this. All right, so TJH said that acquiring JIO to which it pays fees should slash costs by over 50% in the first year. So this is good news for Chance Jam people, and a lot of people buying to the Chance Jam um, IPO, buying to the Chance Jam company, not understanding the operation of the company, not understanding what it is that will drive the company stock price, and they are open that the stock should move. And what Blue Collar Finance always said to people, get an understanding of how the company operates and you cannot do that without upper and understanding the financials of the company so it is the first mercy people who understand company without understanding accounting understanding the financials of the company that sickens me yo oh you do it oh you go about doing it once you understand the company without understanding what is in the financials all right because the financials have so much information all right so when it comes down to chance jam the first thing we always say is the fixed cost of chance jam chance jam have a lot of fixed costs and that is hampering the company now if car go up on the road chance jam have to pay the money if car not go up on the road chance jam have to pay the money that is not good and then when you look at whether or not Chance Jam can drive traffic onto the highway, no, traffic can't drive. Is that a lot of traffic? Hence, Chance Jam profit is under stress. Seen? No, big move by Chance Jam. If Chance Jam is to cut costs, this is what Chance Jam needs to do. Buy up the company because it is this company that is causing those high fixed costs. All right, so this company has a lot of high fiscals. It's just about 3% of the revenue of this company is dependent on the traffic that comes on to Trans Jam Highway, I think. All right, so them get a cut of the revenue that Trans Jam get per vehicle or something like that. But majority of the revenue that this company gets is a fixed revenue, um, um, fixed cost. To Chance Jam. So whether or not vehicle take the road, Chance Jam have to appeal some money to them people. So this is a good move. This is a check move by Chance Jam. Alright. And Chance Jam I say, yo, this I got cut them expense by 50%. This is a money where I got fall right down to the bottom line. Straight down to Chance Jam bottom line. Alright. And <clears throat> what they're saying is that more the so the fixed costs will cut and more this company now will start charging more variable costs. So I think they said the variable cost will move from three percent to now five percent. That is what you want to see. Alright. Um given the position that Chance Jam is in. So the reduction in cost to um Chance Jam as a result of the transaction will be ongoing going forward. Alright. So in June, when the negotiations were first reported. Anderson said that Chance Jam operating costs related to the fees paid to JIO and that 35% of every Chance Jam earned end up in JIO's pocket. So that is what you bought into without even knowing because you don't really understand the operation. Alright, so Chance Jam revenue amounted to $47 million over nine months to September, but its operating expenses totaled $29 million, around half of what 
around half of which uh, would have been paid out to GIO, whistled down profit to $4 million. So, big news to Transjam people. This is what's supposed to move Transjam price. So, as investors, what you want to do now is to incorporate this into the model that you have to value Transjam so you can get the value of Transjam. All right, so you can know how you're buying chance jam what you're paying for chance jam so here chance jam is saving some money which will cause the profit to increase over time going forward so what this means is that this is new cash flow coming into chance jam operation which is supposed to impact the company's costs i mean the company's stock price seen so you know as the investor need to be able to incorporate this into your valuation of chance jam and give the company a stock price all right so make we move on from that big move by management management chance jam management me think them really i think all right so we see them I come up with different ways to try and move the company revenue to try and deal with the company operation so as to save expenses because them really want to create value all right so that's a good look by chance jam. Make we move on from that. 